hi angel and welcome back to my channel my name is Pamela Makobo if you are new here and thank you so much for watching my video today welcome to vlogmas episode one <laughs> this is my first time ever doing vlogmas and I'm so excited okay ah my goodness okay so i will be doing vlogmas i'll be participating in vlogmas this year but um obviously not vlogging and posting every day however i will be vlogging and um compiling like a weekly vlog and posting those until christmas so yeah welcome to vlogmas episode one um today is the first of december 2021 and it's about 8 30 a.m if i'm not mistaken oh 8 20 a.m it is 8 20 a.m in the morning and if you guys can tell from the um the background i'm in my room at home i'm not at res anymore i came back from joburg yesterday and i'm currently in klagsdor in the northwest province so this is a place i call home now <laughs> um so today i just want to get some things done i obviously have a lot of unpacking to do still um I'm, i managed to unpack most of my clothes and um i managed to store away um a lot of my winter clothes guys yo i got here yesterday and it was so hot it is so hot i know i'm always complaining about it being hot in my vlogs but no ways guys no way this place is hot it's hot and humid like the air is sticky oh my goodness this is going to be a very long december <laughs> also um here in Glagstorp, guys, I don't have any friends in Glagstorp. So for me, home is in Freiburg and that's where I grew up. That's where all my friends are. And um, when my family moved here to Glagstorp, I was already in first year. So I didn't have time to make friends because I live in Joburg most of the academic year. And I only come home during this time, like in december so i didn't really have time to make friends and we've been living here for almost four years now okay three years and i still don't have friends you guys are gonna see just how introverted i am when i'm home because in joburg it's easy for me to go out and do whatever because i have friends here you guys are gonna see that your pimena is actually very very introverted and very shy but anyway so today we are going to be having a little productive day I need to unpack um i want to uh also separate some of my clothes um from like the clothes that fit me and the clothes that don't fit me anymore because i will be donating those to charity you know guys it's december there are families that can't afford to buy their kids like christmas clothing and all of that so my mom and i are going to be putting together like clothing um and shoes of course uh that don't fit me my brother and my mom and then we're going to be my mom has like um she knows who she wants to give the clothing to so we will be donating them sometimes um when the uh, municipal workers come and collect um the um rubbish and the trash and everything um it's it's a custom here in Glagstorp to leave like a bag of either clothing or food and then like not in the rubbish obviously but next to it or a box and then you just label it clothes or um food like mostly like tin stuff and whatever and then they know that okay this is um like for you know donation so they take it and then it's either they give it to their families or they know who they can donated to so um it's the culture here i don't know if it's in the, this neighborhood or it's in all of uh Glaxo, but um it's something that my mom has been doing for a while now so because i have like a lot of clothes that don't fit me anymore because i'm so big now <laughs> because i gain so much weight now um she said okay we'll just put them in a box and then we'll take them 
to the place where she knows um she can give it to someone so um yeah that's what we're gonna be doing today guys let me tell you something i woke up to the smell or the scent of ding in the morning you know how in like american shows they're like oh wake up to the smell of breakfast in the morning you know you're home i woke up to the smell of ding in the morning and i was like yeah I'm home. Um, for those of you guys who don't know, if you're not Tswana or if you're not Sutu and you don't know what thing is, thing is fermented sorghum. Okay, so in English it's just fermented sorghum and I texted my mom like three days ago before I moved back home. I texted her and I'm like, girl, please ferment some sorghum for me because I really, really miss it. Um, when I'm at Reza, I never make fermented sorghum because it's such a careful procedure and um, I can risk food poisoning if I don't make it correctly. So I need my mom to teach me how to make it again. <laughs> I already learned, but I forgot and it's such a careful procedure. And luckily for me, my mom works in food safety and nutrition so she's um very strict when it comes to like food contamination and be like making like a clean space when you're cooking so she's gonna teach me how to make things properly okay so let's get into the day going to first go through the contents of this box because when I was at Ray's and I was packing I just found myself throwing stuff in the box and I didn't really sit and um, you know categorize it and then I'm going to be getting into all of the clothing that I want to donate to charity um, for me December is a time of giving it's a time of family spreading love spreading kindness and I just feel as though um, donating all of my items to charity items that I do not wear anymore even though I hold them very dear to my heart they do not fit me anymore I've outgrown them and I feel as though somebody else out there could use them and that's just how I was raised and that's um, something that I also do with my mother so I will be doing that today so donating to charity is also a habit that I want to create a tradition around for myself because I am becoming my own woman now soon enough I'll have my own place and my own household I guess and speaking of creating habits let let us get into the sponsor of today's video so guys i want to tell you guys about this amazing habit tracking app called easy it is available to all apple users on the app store and it is a habit tracking app that i have been using for this month of december it has all these cool features where you can set up a habit you can even personalize your own habit and track your habit and progress as you go along so these are my habits for the week and i can finally tick off the habit that I wanted to build um, donate into charity was one of my biggest goals for this month and I finally did that and I'm able to tick it off and here I get a amazing message of um, positive reinforcement from the app and it is a great way to manage your lifestyle you guys know I love good habits and I love building a routine so this allows you to track your habits and track your routines so that you can keep up with your lifestyle it has amazing features from building habits of weight loss going to the gym all the way to studying and being productive it even has features where you can chat with your friends and keep track of how 
often you've been chatting with your friends or spending time with the people that mean the most to you, especially during this December month where we know that we'll be spending a lot of time with our families. So please check out the app on the App Store if you are a Apple user and I will have all the details in the description box below if you are interested in purchasing the app. into the spirit of vlogmas but anyway i just finished packing um the box after i finished packing the first box of clothing i realized sorry i realized that there were like more bags that i put aside yesterday for items that i'm going to be donating sorry guys i'm just looking for my tripod like the miniature one because I have no idea where it is because I'm holding my camera with my hand right now and that's the reason why it's so wobbly but anyway so um, I just want to show you guys the box I think this is everything that should be everything let's just flip over yeah so this is the box full of clothing some of them are brand new, I've never worn them before. Some of them still have like price tags on them. And I just hope that these make somebody's Christmas or December very, very special. So I'm going to close this up and I'm going to um, leave it in the office for my mom. Whenever she gets the chance to take it where she's taking it. And I put in some bags in here that I don't need anymore and this big bag also hopefully somebody finds it useful shoes are on the bottom and then clothes are on the top it's mostly just summer clothing and maybe two sweatpants in there so yeah this is everything <laughs> afternoon past noon and i'm headed out i am headed to the mall but i'm firstly dropping my brother off at the gym um you guys are seeing me with a wig on because i am fully over my bleached hair i am over it and i'm this close this close to cutting everything off it's just that my brother keeps bullying me and telling me that i'm gonna look crazy with no hair <laughs> so that's why i haven't done it yet so i'm gonna go to the mall i'm gonna go um look for a pair of heels um it's my friend's 21st birthday soon 
so I'll be attending a 21st birthday party and um, I need a pair of heels for my outfit I don't really own a lot of heels because I don't like wearing them because they're uncomfortable um, but yeah we're gonna head out to the mall um, and then I need to pick up like some toiletry stuff as well pick up some prescriptions guys when I tell you guys that it's so hot at home it's so hot and I just checked the weather it's only 27 degrees i feel like 27 degrees is the new 35 i feel like because i am sweating right now the only reason i'm sitting in the living room is because the fan is here <laughs> and it's blowing some cool air down my back i was sweating like crazy do you want to come say hi to the vlog no. <laughs> the way he said no so quickly okay so um let's make our way to the mall <laughs> gym dropping them off and picking them up and then when i was at clicks i just got myself some cotton pads um two packs of gum two cotton pads for my toner and i picked up my my birth control prescription and then um i stopped by pip at the mall to get some tissue oil tissue oil two two bottles and then at Mr. Price I'm in the kitchen right now because I'm going to start cooking um, at Mr. Price I got pajamas for my trip and then at Mr. Price I also got these heels I saw these on Instagram and I was like I have to have them because they're going to go so well with my outfit for Bali's 21st these are the pair of heels that I got. Um, so this is what they look like. Just a pair of heels, stripy, um, trendy. It's giving Bottega. Huh? I put on my jewelry just to go out to the Bottega. Fendi on my body, but my feet is in Bottega. It's giving Bottega. Let's go sit down. Let's go sit down. I was saying that um i feel like i need to end off the vlog here one thing that's exciting that happened is that i got to sign up at a gym so um when my brother was at the gym i just stopped by reception and i asked them like how do i sign up and everything and they're just like oh no i'm just sign in um fill in this form take a picture and then if you have the money you can pay it right now or you can pay the day you want to start it's cool and then I signed up, so as of tomorrow, I'm going to be my brother's gym buddy. I think this is a wrap on a Vlogmas episode 1. I want to edit this vlog and quickly put it out. Um, I have like two backlog videos now. I have to edit. So uh, this draws a conclusion to vlogmas episode one at first when i decided to take part in vlogmas i decided like three days ago and i didn't know how i was gonna do it but i was just happy to be doing it and i am so happy that i'm participating in my first ever vlogmas and i hope you, that you guys enjoyed um this episode and i will see you guys in my next video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already get your friends to subscribe to my channel and have them have their friends subscribe to my channel so that you guys can help little me reach 10k subscribers i will see you guys in my next video bye bye